Good morning. <clears throat> oh, God. Happy Monday. I started my day off with a bang. Literally, like, Sean overslept because he hung out with his dad and his brother last night. So, he overslept. And um, usually he gets up he, about 6.15. So when he got up today, it was 6, I'm going to say 6.37. So he was definitely late. And he has to be to work by 7. So I just got up with him and I was like, let me, um, let me go downstairs and make your lunch. Y'all, I want to go down the damn steps. Oh my God, when I tell y'all, I missed, let me, t let me see how many steps I missed. I missed five damn steps, y'all. And landed on the sixth step on my butt so hard. And then my back hit the fifth step. When I tell y'all, my butt bone hurt. Y'all already know I'm having these back pains. So, oh my gosh, y'all. So, I'm just trying to keep it moving. Like, I was getting ready to um, go to the gym so I could just, like, keep going, keep going. But I still have um, some stuff to do in here. So, I'm going to try to tackle that. And then we'll see if the pain is really, really bad. Then, Because um, y'all know sometimes it gets worse before it gets better. But because of my, my back issue already, <sighs> I can't really take nothing else right now, y'all. But, oh. That's how I woke up, you know what I'm saying? And that woke me up. But I'll be good. And that's why another reason why it's like good to work out. Cause you know, when you get older and you fall, it's not the same as when you fall younger, you know? And I'm not all that old yet, so it's like I'm still okay, but because my back already hurts, it's like, oh my gosh. But yeah, so I'm um about to iron Caden's clothes for school. Well, just his shirt. He's in the shower. And then I'm going to go downstairs and make a smoothie. Oh, that's what we didn't get yesterday. We forgot to get bananas. So I might just go ahead and run across the street and get some um, bananas for my smoothie. Yeah, I'll probably do that. And that's pretty much it, y'all. Oh, no. What is all this stuff coming out of this iron? Let me get his help together. Y'all, when I tell y'all, my butt. <laughs> my butt hurts, y'all. Oh, my God. <sighs> like, when I walk up the steps, but more than anything, when I sit down, oh, my God. <sighs> like, what a way to start your day. You know what I'm saying? And y'all should see how I have all these pillows out in the chair. Oh, that daggone butt bone. I know that thing is bruised. I know that thing is bruised. What's going on, y'all? I'm on my, um, my lunch break. I was going to try it while I was trying to. Relax in the living room because I have like the windows open and stuff. It's so nice out. It's warm. It's like 70 degrees. But, unfortunately, the chairs from downstairs they're not all done so Sean didn't bring up the um, patio set yet but anyway I think I'm gonna just try to lay down <clears throat> for a little bit and rest my butt I'm gonna try to lay down for a little bit. Let me get some more grapes. Yeah, y'all, ain't nothing much going on. Ooh, even when I bent over. Good lord. 
And when I fell, I literally hit my damn tailbone on on the corner of the step. Like right on the, the you know, the bend of the step right there. That shit, boy, that was some pain to wake up to. I love grapes, y'all. Grapes and watermelon. I gotta start getting some watermelon now. Kaden love watermelon. Last night, Kaden wasn't feeling good. He was complaining that his um stomach hurt and his um head was hurting and he said he felt like he was gonna throw up so i don't know what that was about but i gave him some motrin i asked him what he ate at his grandmother's he said chicken and like a vegetable or something like that i believe i know for sure he said chicken i want to say he said broccoli but i don't remember what i was doing. He was saying he wasn't hungry before he didn't feel good. He was saying he wasn't hungry. But Sean um, made him sit down and eat. So he ate. And um, he just started complaining about not feeling good. <sighs> and I, I don't drink too much juices and stuff these days. I try not to. But lately, like the past week or so, I have kind of been. But, um, yeah. Let me open the door so Kaden can come in. Uh, I'm going to go lay down for the rest of my break, y'all. I might have to combine this vlog with tomorrow's vlog because y'all don't want to just see me walking around the house complaining about my tailbone i'll be back let me lay down for a little bit yeah so tomorrow i have my physical therapy appointment like really early in the morning i think i'm gonna go to urgent care after because the pain in my butt bone and now because i had to kind of like sit crooked to kind of take my weight off of the tailbone my damn back hurts like i'm jacked up like tomorrow i'm not even gonna be able to do no type of therapy so he's gonna be looking at me like what the hell <sighs> anyway kaden i don't care but you need to get in here and clean this daggone room you got trash over there on the floor you got your shirts all messed up in the drawer why do you have to mess everything up and i took my time out and made everything neat put it back in that drawer neatly don't just shove it in there see how you be stop being trifling Pick up your belt and hang it on the hook where it belongs. I don't want to see nothing on the floor in the room. Close your closet door and pick up that trash over there. And don't get comfortable eating in your room. So this is the last thing you have up in here. And I want the trash to go downstairs in the kitchen trash when you're done. Pick that trash up. Trash. Right there. Oh, you wanna say hi to the vlog? Okay, don't wanna say hi, y'all. My bad. Hey guys. Ooh. Just finished doing my homework. Tell me what you want to do. I'm watching um a movie. It's called. Hmm, what is it called? I'll put it up here. It's called Open Season 2. The little one in the yellow. That's what he's watching, y'all. Go ahead, babe. Alright, I'm about to go lay down, kidding. Alright, y'all. So. Sean's uh, nephew is downstairs. I guess I'm going to go downstairs and at least speak so I'm not being rude. But I got to tackle these steps. And I have to carry this plate down, so give me a minute so they downstairs in the basement i ain't like going all the way down there but i spoke to him earlier 
anyway but i don't have much of an appetite y'all i had a piece of fish that sean made he um heated up for me when he came home i ate that and i'm about to just eat this yogurt <sighs> and i'm just gonna relax i'm waiting for um sean's nephew to leave and then he's gonna um come clean out the tub for me and fill it up with some epsom salt so i could take a bath and soak my tailbone but i'm about to just chill in a bit and watch something on tv until he's um ready to do that i don't know what a remote is oh there it is <sighs> so yeah y'all like i said y'all already know during the week it's not much for me to vlog But, um, depending on what they say at Urgent Care tomorrow, I might not make it to work. So, I'll let y'all know. Because this is bad when you have to sit down all day. Uh-uh. And it hurts to sit. Like, it's just bad. But, alright, y'all. Good morning, Jaybirds. So, I am on my way to my physical therapy appointment. And, <clears throat> let me tell y'all. He gonna be like, you can't even do half the stuff. I could barely sit down. I did um, end up soaking in the bath last night. And Sean made the bath water real, real hot too. So I soaked in that. And um, that helped a little bit. And then he put Tiger Balm on my tailbone, y'all. So that helped a lot. Got me through the night as far as like sleeping and stuff. But usually during the night, I do like turn to each side throughout the night um but it didn't hurt until like i would say like the late late hours of the night like well early early morning i was like four five in the morning it started hurting um and then when i got up this morning it really was hurting so like even when i'm driving going over the bumps it's hurting my damn butt <sighs> so i'm headed to my physical therapy appointment i was gonna try to do um urgent care this morning but being that I have to be to work at 10 o'clock I don't want to risk um, being late so if anything depending on how it goes today um, I may just end up having to like leave work early um, yesterday I did end up leaving work early just because I tried everything to kind of like ease the pain and nothing was helping I was standing up I was sitting on pillows like nothing was helping <sighs> I didn't even think I fell. Well, I know I fell hard, but good Lord. Like, being that I skipped like five set, five steps, it's just, I landed on that daggone step. Oh my gosh, y'all. <clears throat> so, I'm very, very early. I think I'm like the very first appointment. And they were saying no one ever wants, oh, the speed bumps. They were saying no one ever wants these, um, Sorry, y'all. Appointments because they're too early. But look, the agony I'm in. And I have Caden on the phone because he has to get on the bus. So I want to make sure he gets on the bus. So I have him on the phone with me because he's about to leave out the house. Literally in like eight minutes. So I'm just like, let me just come on so I don't be late. Oh, God. Oh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, good Lord. <sighs> Can't be doing all this falling. But anyway, I'll hit y'all when I get out and let y'all know what happens. All right, so, just left my appointment. My deck on um, appointments are getting earlier and earlier. So I'm trying to get in every week. So next week they only have Friday at seven, but that's spring break. So what I do is I just run, Katie and I'll still be asleep and I'll come here and get my appointment out the way. But I was talking to um, one of the girls, one of the girls here and um, she only works 20 hours a week and she still has her full benefits, $5 co-pays. So, uh, I'm really trying to go part-time. But yeah, anywho, I'm about to um, run to the store. Kaden, you know, it's allergy season. 
and Kaden has allergies really, really bad. So him and Sean both do, but Kaden, ooh, 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 ooh. Lord, y'all. I feel like a freaking 85 year old lady getting in this daggone car. I'm gonna try to see if I can get another phone um, mount thingy. Camera mount for y'all. But yeah, um. Whew. So. She put uh, she had me lay on my back and do some exercises, bring my knees up to my chest and hold it. And um let me see if I can position y'all right. Hold on. Alright, is that better? Yeah, that's better for now. So I did that and then um I laid out when I was doing those exercises, I was laying on a big old ice pack on my upper back. Of course, right now, the majority of my pain right now is my my tailbone. And, um, what else? Oh, that's really it. And she had me kind of, like, stretch, turn. And then she wrote me a, um, she gave me some paperwork to give me with some exercises to do daily. And as far as the gym, she told me don't go on a treadmill and um, no machines, no weights at all. And if I'm gonna do cardio, the best cardio for me at the moment. Oh, sorry y'all, gotta get a new one. All right, this isn't gonna work. I'm gonna have to take you off out of here. Hold on. All right, I'm gonna have to hold y'all and then I'm gonna I'm obviously not gonna be able to drive holding y'all too long. But she was just saying um, that if I'm gonna do, sorry for the lighting, if I'm gonna do cardio, um, to, it's best for me to do the gym, um, not the gym, the, the bike, not the treadmill. And um, no weights at all, and just a lot of stretching, so. <sighs> And I'm, I'm wondering, because I'm like, okay, well, if it's not good to do the treadmill, then are you saying it's not good to walk? And I meant to ask her that. So, um, but because what she was saying, she was like, throughout the day, like every hour, she was like, take a, a five minute break and like walk, do stretches. And I'm like, um, yeah, if I had that flexibility to do so, but I don't have that flexibility with my job. So that's where the issue let lies because I have to you know go and break on my schedule breaks and stuff like that like you know what I mean so I don't know um they're like sticklers for being on time and even though when I scheduled my appointment I told the girl that I was gonna be late because it was a school day and I had to make sure my son got on the bus and stuff like that and she was like oh um I don't know why you were told that that's not okay she was like we have um back-to-back -back appointment so it's cutting your time and if someone else behind you comes at their scheduled time she was like i'm gonna have to see them at their time blah, blah blah so i'm like okay i get it you know and i was like i did come on sat saturday um i thought my appointment was for 4 30 and i actually was here earlier than that but it was for 4 10 and i just missed whoever so um that's another thing like i need to excuse me make sure i stay on top of my um my appointment really was trying to get an appointment scheduled for thursday because that's my day off of course and it would just work better but um they didn't have anything for thursday so i just took friday at seven and i'm like all right well i have to be seen like i need to get in there every week so i'm just gonna keep up with that but yeah so now i am headed to walmart i gotta get Kaden his prescription uh, i mean not prescription his medication for his allergies and um i need to get a new camera mount for the car and um some bananas and stuff because i haven't been able to make my smoothies we forgot to get bananas and i need to get a little bit more um of the frozen fruits and what else oh and i want to get a lamp for the um living room i might get that now but i think i'll probably wait because i don't need to be lifting nothing the way i feel right now so i'll probably wait to hold off on getting a lamp but yeah so that's what i'm doing y'all y'all know i haven't 
really been running too many morning errands lately. I've been like in the house and stuff like that, but I definitely gotta get my babe some um, Claritin because he woke up sneezing like 50 times this morning. <sighs> so I'm gonna do that. And then y'all, okay, so as y'all know, I'm new to um, vlogging and I see that I okay so I really want to start utilizing my vlog camera right now um, I'm utilizing my old um, iPhone 7 plus and um, it's doing the job you know for now but the fact of the matter is that I actually invested in a vlog camera um, like two and a half three years ago and three years ago probably use that camera like twice not even three years ago i'm lying i'm lying i bought that camera i have another camera that i bought three years ago but i have this the, the vlog camera i purchased um two two years ago or a year and a half ago or so and um i probably only use it like twice so my dilemma is i need to really learn how to um edit and stuff using my laptop but the thing is i bought a macbook a used one a refurbished one a couple years back and um kaden when he was younger he got like the headphones the little plug he got it stuck in there so it always thinks that there's a headphone um attached so i don't have any volume like i, I don't have any uh, auto audio so i can't obviously edit I can take it to a store, which I've been saying I'm going to do. So I might go ahead and try to do that this weekend. I see if I can get that taken care of. And then I can just go ahead and keep rocking out with iMovie. Because that's what I'm using right now. But I want to kind of like um, upgrade and move more into like Final Cut Pro. Um, so I want to ask y'all. By me just starting out and stuff. Do y'all think that it's necessary for me to go that route right now? I mean, I really eventually do want my... I want my content to be, you know, good, professional. I want, I want like, really nice edits and stuff like that. Like, I really want to get to learn all of that. But right now, watching my content, do you guys think it's necessary for me to invest in all of that right now? Or is it okay just keep building up my channel and then get things little by little? I think when I said it out loud, that sounds like the smartest route. But let me know how you guys feel about that or whatever. But I'm definitely not about to be out here buying, like, the Canon G7X and doing all of that. But I did get a nice camera um, that I paid, like, almost $400 for. So I think that's good to start, okay? And I just need to learn how to use that before I go into anything else. It has the flip screen and all of that. So anyway, um, let me know what y'all think. And leave it in the comment below. If you're new to my channel, welcome, welcome, welcome. Um, don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell so that you're notified when I upload a video. And um, this and every Thursday, I do an episode, that a series. And the episode is called Unwind with Chrissy J. Where we um, drink wine, light a candle, and we just talk about hot topics. Like whatever's going on um, in the world, whatever's going on in entertainment, whatever's going on um you know in our lives like as far as you know i don't know topics like being a single mom or being a single dad or last week was co-parenting um dealing with a child with um you know who's hyper or who has add or even autism i mean kaden doesn't have autism but that's a real topic and there are people out there that are battling um all you know autism and getting adjusted to dealing with a child that has it and things like that so there's just a lot of topics that we can discuss you know it's a wide spectrum so if you guys have any topics or any ideas that you want to discuss come on as my channel grows, we'll probably start doing Unwind with Chrissy J Live so that we can interact with you guys. And I think that'll be good. But yeah, let me go ahead and try to make it to Walmart, get through this traffic I'm on, and uh, I'll be back. Hey y'all, so I'm back in the house. This is some of the stuff I got from Walmart. I already put some stuff away, but to 
got my um, shaking and stuff when I walk, when I'm vlogging, I bought this. I see a lot of vloggers have that, so. I'm just getting a little bit by a little bit, and I'm about to make my smoothie. I literally have like 15 minutes before I start work, so. That's it. Alright guys, so I am done my smoothie. As you can see by the keyboard, I'm at work. <clears throat> so. <sighs> won't be vlogging too much today, but um, I am going to make some crab legs, some Dungeness crab legs and corn on the cob on my lunch break today. So I'll probably vlog me making that. And then I have two boiled eggs downstairs. So this smoothie and my two boiled eggs are going to be my breakfast. I'm really trying to do like the no carb thing. So we'll see how this goes. And um, yeah, so as you guys know, work has started and I won't be able to vlog too much, but I definitely will check back in on my breaks. All right, y'all. Oh. So, I'm having technical difficulties right now. So, I have tech support working on my um, system. Oh, oh. It's like when I get up from sitting, it hurts so bad. I'm going to have to lay on some ice again tonight. My butt is like sore. But, yeah, so... I have tech support working on my system issue right now and so um i'm just running down here real quick to throw on my lunch while he's doing what he's doing which is dungeness crabs so that's good enough for more and then what I'm gonna do is uh, uh, make a, cut my corn the cob in half and I'm gonna put it in this bowl here and normally I keep saying normally this is just true Normally I would eat it with um, like a butter sauce, but to go a healthier route, I'm just going to season it up real good and then um, use a vinegar dipping sauce as my sauce of choice. I'm going to season it up. I want garlic and herb flavor. I'm not doing it how I normally would do it, like my trays when I sell them. But I'm going to use this. This isn't the one that I normally would use. But this is good as well. So I put a little bit on there. And then I have another. So, I mean, a seasoning. Where is it? We have so much seasoning. We got to organize this stuff. This thing actually me because Sean be organizing it but I can mess it up all over he be so annoyed y'all but anyway I'm going to use some garlic powder which is this one so I'll sprinkle a little bit of that on there some black pepper And then I'm looking for my um my old bay seasoning. Cause I don't use this right here. This isn't real old bay. This right here, y'all? No. No, 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 no. That is not no real old bay. Okay. So if y'all been using that, y'all been misled. I got my own old bay seasoning up in here, okay? I put it in this parsley flakes um, bottle, but it's not parsley, obviously. But this is real obey. Y'all see all of the herbs and stuff in there? Yes, this is real obey seasoning, y'all. Tell me, y'all, change the game. It'll change the game. So, yeah, that's good enough for right now. I'm going to turn it. 
I'm gonna turn this on high. So I'm about to corn to cook, and then now I'm about to rinse off my corn. And I don't know if y'all know about this, but the Cajun Sparkle from Popeyes. So that's gonna start steaming up. I let that steam up for about seven, eight minutes because they're already cooked. And then the corn in the cup with the boiling, and we cover it up. And we get to go. Now. This is the finished product. So, um, <sighs> yeah, I'm about to throw it down, y'all. It's nice and seasoned. Normally, it would be looking real juicy and all that, but. I'm not doing butter, so it is what it is. Alright, so I'm on my lunch break. I don't know why today is dragging the way it's dragging, but it literally feels uh, literally feels like I've been working all day. Like literally. Um yeah, so my pain in my but it's getting like worse, I think, just from sitting so long and I don't want to take any pain meds, so I'm gonna just um, whew, lay down real quick. Uh, I'm walking like I'm pregnant, y'all. I'm like wobbling. But um, I'm gonna just go ahead and lay down a little bit on an ice pack during my break. Caden should be walking in the door literally in like 10 minutes. <sighs> so he's probably gonna interrupt me if I fall asleep, but whatever. So yeah, let me get my butt in the bed and get some rest. Y'all, I'm on my last break and I am chillaxing out on the patio. Sean brought up the table and the chair that he finished spray painting. Oh, it feels so good to just be out here. I cannot wait till we get our grill and can eat dinner out here. I just love outside. But it feels so, so good out here. So yeah, I'm just chilling, enjoying the breeze, the sound of nature. I'll show y'all my view. Feels so good out here. The head the vlog. Hey guys. Oh, you guys, he spoke. <laughs> <laughs> he said hi. <sighs> Alright, I'm going to just do a video appointment because the only one in person this Friday I need to be seen or talked to earlier than that. So, my butt is hurting extremely bad, and from sitting all day, I guess it's like, look, eight hours is a wrap, so I had, to, I had to get up out that chair and, like, get off work. So, now I'm trying to schedule an appointment or a video appointment with my doctor to see if, um, y'all, y'all gotta excuse me, I look a hot mess. But I'm trying to see if I could um, get a video appointment for tomorrow to see if he could put me in for like a temporary, like, I don't know, FMLA for like maybe, I would say maybe another week. I'm hoping that my butt bone feels better because this is unreal, y'all. Like, there's no way in the world I can do 10 hours with this pain. And like, every time I get up, it hurts so bad. I cannot even describe. <sighs> So I'm just gonna go ahead and schedule an appointment for tomorrow, a video appointment at 1.30. Cause if I wanna go in person, he's not available until Friday and I cannot wait that long. Look who came to visit me. Woo kiss, woo kiss. Look who came to visit his favorite auntie. Say hi to the vlog. Yeah, what that's I my do? other baby. Is tell him stop. Is that Dinks? Are you in there? I'm not going to tell him Say hi to the vlog. Say hi. Hi. Say hi. Say hi. Hi, Weeks. This one right here is so quiet. It's my baby. Say hi, You say hi. Say hi. Huh? Who's that? Who? I'll tell her. Hey. Where you 
Thanks. All right, y'all. We're going to end the vlog. Sean's going to end it. Oh. Okay, that's it. That was it. All right, y'all. <laughs> I'm about to go upstairs and get in the shower because I smell like Saturday. And uh, I'm going to relax. And then get this rubbed on my back. This is a massager, y'all. But look at the back, the warning on it. Can y'all see that? Cancer and reproductive harm. So I'm about to go to the website and see exactly what that means. What is that? Right here. Me and Crystal wants to tell you guys to be positive and live good. And have a conscious life. Mm -hmm. That's L-I-P-H-E, which stands for... Love, inspiration, positivity, health, and beauty. Boom.